Uh, what are your thoughts on the lack of coverage for the Tour de France? Oh. And do you think since the Lance era, in quotes there, that cycling in America has faded? I barely knew it was here. Yeah. Linda? I'm telling you, who cares? <laughs> I couldn't care less. Nobody cares. I, I respect overseas in Europe. They love it. They love the cycling. People ride their bikes in this country, but they're not doing it yeah, the way they're doing Yeah, we bikes in America. It. Yeah. Like, like, I think we like them they're for annoying. ourselves. Yeah. You know what? Fuck bikes. I know. They're in, <laughs> you know, Gary, <laughs> Gary, they're in our way. Gary, they're in our way. Listen. Listen, Julie, this is class. You know what? Ameri- Listen, as somebody who wasn't born in America, the thing I respect, but as uh, such a happy American, the thing I respect about America is also its weakness. We're so insular. Like, we're finally getting around to soccer, but like, if you're doing well outside the US as a sport, we out of spite say fuck you. Like, Formula One, go fuck yourself. Like, cycling, go fuck yourself. And for a long time, even soccer, we're just funny that way. Don't shove it down my throat, though. With the soccer, I mean, I have a hard time. Well, I got to do highlights you work, of it. You work for the organization that, that shoves soccer. It. No, that I know doesn't, they, that they love sho- soccer. ESPN is the smartest. When they sign the right, all of a sudden, miraculously, after they lock up the World Cup for the rest of our lives, yeah. they start showing me top ten plays from fucking Europe. Right, and it's always number one. Soccer is yeah. always Some number one in top ten. Some fucking bicycle kick from yeah. La Liga. I Who mean, gives come a fuck? on. All right, let's move on to what Julie. You're the best. Great love call. you. Thank you for calling. 